supermarket, right? And supermarkets, they're a shocking place for me, you know, because there's too many shiny things to play with. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> you just go there. That's a whisk there, just so you know. In case you're going, what the hell is he doing there? The, uh, it's just pleasure in a turtle there. <laughs> Who left that in the supermarket just on a shelf up there? Well, there's a turtle. He needs pleasure in there. <laughs> what a horrible image to bring up there. <laughs> what kind of freaky supermarket would... I probably should stop pleasuring the turtle while I'm talking to you. I'll just go and stop it. Either talk or pleasure a turtle. Like the cheap reptile slut you are. <laughs> I wonder how long I could keep doing that before somebody complained in writing. <laughs> Pleasure to turn. I'll just put him back up there on the shelf. There That's great, that, isn't it? Because he's clearly an imaginary turtle, but you can't stop looking at him, can you? Look at you. Look at you all just going, what, you're just going to leave a turtle there? An imaginary turtle sitting on the thing there. <laughs> I'll put him over here in this imaginary drawer. Yeah, hang on a second. Just leave it open a bit. We don't want him to die. <laughs> no imaginary animals were harmed in the making of tonight's show. The, um, except this panda. He's <laughs> <laughs> not real. That's people going, oh, don't kick the imaginary panda. <laughs> Sorry. It's all right, you can kick the shit out of a panda. It doesn't matter, you can beat a panda in the face. Even a real panda, it doesn't matter. Because they've already got black eyes and no one knows. You, know what I mean? you just get coming here! Oh, some zoo visitors are coming. 